向こうゲームスインディーソフトウェア Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Woki, and I'm here with some... He literally just... Oh, he just said the title. It's a Kintama game for the DS, I believe this is the first one. Why am I here with this? Well, because we couldn't record short an archive this week. But I still wanted to release some, maybe because Zen was busy. Um, and I'm also looking busy for next week, but we'll figure it out. Hopefully by next week we'll be back, but I felt bad not releasing anything in town related for, uh, this week. So I decided to, hey, play this DS game that I've been thinking about playing for a while now. And here we go. Now here's the problem with this game, as you can tell right here. This was only released in Japan. So I have no idea what any of this says. So, um, what I'm gonna do is, as these characters start, uh, complaining, I'm gonna try and see if I can live translate this. One moment. I have no idea what they're saying right here. <clears throat> okay, let's see. What? Oh, no, they're going too fast. There he is. Okay. I've given up on this. So, yeah, this game is very text-heavy and adventure-heavy, and I tried my best to look for some kind of uh, English translation for it. Couldn't find it, which is kind of a damn shame, because there's a lot of talking, as you can see here in the background. Um, also, in Brandon and I saw right here, I mean, that looks a lot like... Um, they look very similar to the characters. I will say they look a little bit... Weird, some of them. Like, Shinpachi, that looks fine. This Gintoki could have been a little bit better. There's something in the eyes that are missing. See, that's perfect. That's an angry Shinpachi. That also looks pretty good, actually. But yeah, this is a DS game. See, and that looks good. Kagura, looking fine. And then something happens. Someone comes into this. Here's what I've been able to ga gather so far. Is that... <clears throat> Racket Man over here from the Shinsengumi shows up and then he asks the job for us and then we have to go uh, do the job and collect money because obviously we're going to be owing our rents as is always the case. Like most Gintama stories actually, I assume the rent is due and Kentucky needs to pay it so we're going to be doing jobs in order to actually get it done. Some good faces right there. <clears throat> Kentucky looking very contented with everything. Also, really like these little sprites at the back here, down down here as well. They look pretty nice, actually. <laughs> They're just kind of vibing as the actual story is going on in the main. There we go. <clears throat> now, here's the other weird thing about the game. I'm gonna have to do a lot of switching. There's no controls to it because this is a DS game. I have to swipe left and right, like right here. <laughs> but thankfully, I've played enough of this first level to figure out what I have to do at least for this stage. So we're gonna go collect some money. If you actually had no any info about this, I would love to know. It's a damn shame that this couldn't be found translated. There's a lot of Shonen Jump games that just were never um, translated. Yamazaki, I think, is this guy's name. I just remember them for the Prince of Tennis bit with the with the bracket ball. <clears throat> but I think I'm finally remembering some of the names. Okay, let's go. So how does this game... As you can see here, the little Just Away dolls, that's my health. Um, and I think on the top is... My current location, I can't figure that out. But I have to just kill these guys. And then also collect money. How do I jump? I have to flick up. Oh, yeah. Down back to this era of gaming, everyone. <laughs> Where people were trying to figure out what to do with the DS. And the answer was, some of them were like, I don't know, do something with the stylus. Maybe you can only control characters with the stylus. Um... <clears throat> which eventually DS games would stop doing. I forget when they stopped doing, but they eventually would stop. It's kind of like Wii games, but a less annoying version of it, because eventually people figured out, like, oh, okay, the, du the dual screen doesn't have to be always used, and we don't always have to use the touch if we can't think of a good way. Um, so yeah, I just kind of move forward here. I'll look for some monies. Get that monies. Jump. Jump. Okay. Okay. Jump, jump, jump. There we go. Oh, I accidentally made it smaller. One moment. There we go. Slap him up. <clears throat> Whoop. Out of my face. Okay. I have no idea what I'm fighting here. Some kind of flubber monster, from what I can tell. Ah, jump over here. I'm surprised I can make that. This game doesn't feel that bad, actually. Because, again, maybe it's comparative because I played a lot of the 
Naruto game on DS, and I remember that controlling kind of funky. But this doesn't control too bad. So before I kill that thing, okay, it doesn't look like there's anything else, so I can just kill it. And then everyone's happy, yay, I did it. <clears throat> and I assume they're all here telling me some jokes, making some reference to... Go down here. Reference to Japanese culture that I don't fully understand, but I'm sure it's very hilarious when you know the actual reference to it. Or maybe it's a poop joke. One of the two. <laughs> or a butt joke. Poop, butt, sex. One of those kind of jokes, I'm sure. Someone's at the door. I think I'm paying off my money or I'm getting more money. Not 100% sure on this. Shimpachi seems to be flabbergasted, and then of course she comes in, takes all of our money. But at least the rent's paid, I think. Or at least part of the rent is paid. Because he goes, well. I actually wonder how far into this it is, guys. Okay, Yamazaki's there, but I don't think Catherine might not be here. I don't know. So I click. So now I think I can just freely roam around and look for work. I think that's how it works now. So let me see if I can go all the way here and eventually find some work. Hey! Hasegawa. I think maybe I can do something with him. Anything, Hasegawa? No. I like his little sprite, though. <laughs> oh, okay. I buy stuff from him. Can I buy Shonen Jump? I can buy pervy magazines. Can I buy a Shonen Jump though? There has to be a Shonen Jump. Yeah, that's Jump! Okay, okay, okay. Asagawa, I would like to pay for this. Can I actually? Well, I'm just gonna leave. Peace out. I assume I paid for it. <clears throat> or maybe I didn't. Again, the bummers of not knowing. Doom, 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 doom. But yeah, this would have been great to see translated, because it seems like a good old time here. Oops. Cannot go further here, so it's time for me to go back. I wonder if I jump. No, I can't jump on him in this screen. Hmm. Gotta find more jobs. Gotta make more money. Go here. Wait, maybe in there? Nope. Worf was worth a shot, though. Hey! Uh, I don't know what any of this means. <laughs> I think I may have ordered something. This does kind of look like. I don't think I have enough money for any of this. Okay, I think I was ordering food. This is also the wrong order. If I had known what some of these were, that would have been obviously for Gintoki and not them. Well, well. Let's keep looking. Any other jobs in my hotel? Diet? At the very least, I can try and find other characters. Anything here? Nope. So yeah, I was trying to think of where they could possibly be in the timeline. But there was Sachan, there was Hasegawa, his Yamazaki, Otsu obviously, but... Hmm. Anything here? Nope, nope, nope. wonder if I'm just going in circles now. Either a circle or a very long path forward. But whatever, I'm sure I'll eventually get to somewhere if I just keep going. Wouldn't that just be a mean thing if uh, I just never found another job? <laughs> nope. It's looking a little bit. Oh no, there's back our, our, our office. 
If I talk to Kagura anything? Nope. You got anything to say, dog? Sure. Oh, you can come out with us. Oh. Come on, Sadaharo. Wait. I can piss on stuff. Alright. Let's go pee on stuff then, I guess. <laughs> they seem to be not too happy with me going around finding places to piss. I wonder if YouTube is going to be alright with me saying piss. I'm sure it's fine. I mean, that's what's happening. It's not being shown. So we should be fine. Kagura okay with him pissing. Compared to the to the other two. <laughs> she seems to be... Oh, can we go? Okay, yeah. There we go. <clears throat> Piss. Any other place? Where else is open right now that I can go in and do take care of business? Oop, tree. This is the only the only one so far that's actually a legit place for a oh, and of course he doesn't want to go. Go over there. Good boy. Oh, oops. There we go. You should be able to see this pissing action in full screen. Or as full as I can make it. Go, go, go. Right there. Sadaharu, perfectly okay with it. Two out of four of the members are okay with him peeing everywhere. That has to mean for something. there. Where next? Next. Oh, I can go back in the back alley. I didn't even realize. No. There we go. Come on, game. Be with me here. I think we're back at the start. Mmm, there's obviously a place we missed to pee at, but I think we can find it back here, actually. <clears throat> yep. Yep, yep, yep. Has to be here. Yep. We did it! <laughs> Shibachi, no help on this one. Oh, is this the car collectible cards I can get? Oh, it's a shame that I don't have any cards now. Nope. Can I watch TV? I can! The weather girl's on. Not sure what she's saying. Nothing else? <gasps> Check for food. Carrots, potatoes, not sure, not sure. But oh, that means that we don't have any. Shime, shame. Well, we'll go to the back alley and see if there's anything for me there. I was able to go, there we go. One more tour around the block, see if I can find either one more person, or at the very least, um, another activity to do. This is the problem with not knowing any Japanese, and not knowing what I'm actually supposed to be doing in this game. Oh god. Here we go. And also the problem with these touch controls constantly screwing with the... Emulation size. <laughs> I'm t constantly touching the borders of stuff. I think this is the just away factor, isn't it? I can't go in here though. Again, anyway. 
I must have to have a job of some kind. Wait. Really? It kind of looked like I could go in there. I think I'm gonna have to just call it here because I don't know what where if there's anything else for me to do here. <laughs> oh well. Uh yeah, it's a shame. If they ever define an actual English translation for this, I would love to try it, because I'd like to be interested to see what they would do more for a Gintama game, but fortunately this is all I can do. But that's the end of the video, everyone. Thank you very, very much for watching. Uh hopefully see you next week for more Shonen Archive, but for now. I can leave you off of here, and I'll see you guys next time. Till next time, peace out.